and the TLC match is underway. There have been numerous TLC matches in WWE history. The first came over a decade ago at the 2000 SummerSlam. The rules are much like your standard ladder match. Your object is to climb a ladder and retrieve the prize hanging down from above. Triple H looking to fly. As we watch Steve Austin, let's get your take on it. A good opportunity for the champ to try out some new things here. What's the worst that can happen? A loss? Who cares? It's not like the title's on the line. Ow! Ooh. Wow, look at this. We're seeing one person do their best to make sure another... Oh, man! Did oh. you hear that? Oh, wow. That must have caused major damage. You just can't train to be ready for an assault like that. Attack it. Boom. Oh, wow. What an attack. The animosity levels of this match just continue to rise. Make no mistake about it. This is a war. This is an all-out war. He's showing no signs of letting up. He's simply reminding him that he's here. The crowd clearly divided for this triple threat match. There doesn't seem to be a runaway favorite in this one. Oh, man! That's it! Did you hear that? I'm just glad I didn't feel it. Wow, he's still down after that. Boy, he just got laid out. The Cerebral Assassin has had many story wars in the annals of WWE. The one I'm thinking of was versus Mankind. Man, on Raw and pay-per-views, these two beat the holy heck out of one another literally all over the world. We're looking at complete domination here. Steve Austin making his statement as we speak. He wants this battle decided inside the ring. And that's why he's such a great athlete, such a, an important superstar. He's setting it up. I don't think there's an area on that back that's not suffering right now. Yeah, when he wakes up in the morning, the only thing on his body that's not going to hurt is his pajamas. Kane, you mentioned the rivalries of the game, and Mankind is certainly at the top of that list. Yes. Their matches weren't matches. They were gruesome battles. The game and Mankind gave new meaning to the term physical brutality. And you know, thinking of that physical brutality is almost too much. Triple H and Mankind's disdain for one another carried over into steel cages, boiler room brawls, no disqualification matches. I mean, you name it. These guys battled one another in it. Extra slow getting back to his base here. And Triple H hits the ground. He's setting it up. I like it. Let's get this thing done inside the ring. Stunner, there's no escape from that. You're right about that. You're never the same after a stunner. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. He's making a statement here with this attack. Warm up the buses. This one's over. What an attack. And I don't have one problem with it. In the WWE, you do what you have to do to get ahead. Like in any business, only the strong survive. That'll do it. Steve Austin taking him out with the Stone Cold Stunner. One of the greatest moves in the history of WWE. If he keeps up this pace, this could turn real ugly real fast. Man, he's still down after that move. I almost wonder if his bell got seriously wrong there. And that's how you do it. Extra slow getting back to his base here. Look at that. 
Another merciless blow. I think it's safe to say that if they got up from that, it would be a miracle. Wow! If he keeps this up, this could be over quick. Ow! Ooh. Whoa! I think that one made the entire building shake. Just think of what that will do to your body. No thanks. I'm retired. Back in the ring now. Yeah, let's just see how long they can keep it in the ring. Look at this, just a little further. And it's apparent that The Rock has been injured. I think he's got it. Does he have it? He can't do it. He can't get that thing unhooked. Look how slow he is to recover here. That was some serious punishment. If this continues, we could be talking about something no one wants to discuss. Facial reconstructive surgery. I know you don't like to talk about your facial reconstruction. Victory may be within reach right here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This isn't where you want to be. I think he almost has it. Oh, I thought he had it. He lands the strike with great accuracy. Oh, what a shot. That did some serious damage. You can't take too many of those and expect to be in the match much longer. Man, Triple H, what offense. Uh-oh, he's in position, ready to strike. Triple H, the prototypical ring general. He's so good at knowing how to control a match. Triple H may be out of it. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt-kicking right here. I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. Steve Austin showing some expert prowess here. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Steve Austin. There's nobody, and I mean nobody, better in the WWE than that man right there, Triple H. Are we going to see it, Cole? I think so. Oh, what a move from The Rock. Now that's how you sweep an opponent under the carpet. You don't want to get caught outside the ring for too long. What happened to you? You used to love being outside the ring. Look at this. Just a little further. It's not going to take long to bring it down now. The tension, the drama, this is electric. Look at the back of my arm, Cole. Look at the goosebumps. I love this. Oh, out of nowhere. Whoa, a direct hit. Talk about getting tagged and not in the middle of next week. Wow, he just slammed him with ease. And almost slammed him right through the ring floor. We now have to question if he'll be able to come. Never have so few inches seen so far away. This is it. This is going to be it. He's right there. He unhooks that thing, and this is over. Oh, this is scary. I can tell you from experience, it feels like you're 10 miles in the air now. There's your winner, ladies and gentlemen. I can't believe what we saw in that match.